Okay, uh, time for another video. Uh, I'm a little bit excited at the moment. Um, ever since I was a child, I've dreamed about owning a grappling hook. Uh, always wondered where I might find one. Um, I think I was watching a, a TV show. I can't remember if it was Samurai or uh, The Man From U.N.C.L.E. But um, I seen a grappling hook on there and it was sort of hard back in those days, you know, to to find, you know, there was no internet and stories and how would I uh, come across a grappling hook and uh, finding the money wouldn't be easy. Uh, but I recently watching a YouTube video and I seen somebody who had a grappling hook uh, look more like a boat anchor than a grappling hook really. Um, it was rigid and... Um, really difficult I would imagine to transport anywhere because it, you know it's so large and traveling around with it would be difficult uh, but I recently found a very portable grappling hook uh, it's a beautiful thing uh, it folds down as you can see and to deploy it you simply screw this shaft out and drop the hooks out Wind it back into position, and believe it or not, this has a um, <clears throat> a load bearing capacity of 350 kilos. Um, I only weigh 90 kilos, so um, as you can imagine, it can take quite a bit of weight. Um, so I am excited. Uh, even before I found this, um, I was <clears throat> toying with the idea of doing some rock climbing. Um, thought I'd be down for a bit of rock climbing. We have no experience, uh, no gear to speak of. I mean, I do have rope. Um, I have rope, so I can't see why I couldn't do some rock climbing. But, um, and some paracord and things. But, uh, so I've gone and bought some more equipment. Um, now that I've got the grappling hook, uh, after all these years of just dreaming, uh, I've also gone and bought um, some of these things, uh, which should come in handy, uh, I would imagine, with the rope and the grappling hook and the stuff. Um, so I should probably learn how to tie a knot, because the only knot I can tie is a granny knot, um, which I, I suspect would uh, not be the best type of um rope tying skills to have when you go rock climbing I mean it doesn't have to be rock climbing I might scale a factory wall or something uh, I'll keep you up to date on that one um, and uh, hopefully make a video in future of me uh, going on some sort of an adventure with that you know um, but uh, I mean I, realistically uh, I am a little bit of a pessimist uh, try not to get too paranoid but I'm a little bit pessimistic so I went and bought some supplies uh, in case there's a mishap uh, I've got a tourniquet uh, a couple of Israeli bandages um, and a little baggy thing that I can carry those in um, so just in case, you know, and then I've got some um, some painkillers in me. Hello, Titty, Kitty, Tin, Titty, Hello, Titty, Hello, Kitty, Tin. Uh, so, wish me luck. Um, I mean, I'll, I'll probably have to get someone else to film it. Um, but uh, hopefully everything goes well. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. Okay, I'll, I love you guys. Take care. Bye-bye.